life is going digital, whether people like it or not. So we help people who don't normally get the opportunity to have digital skills and get them in a fun, engaging way to become more digitally included. I was doing youth work and a group asked me to make a video and I just saw how powerful it was, it gave them a voice. So I started working with a team of freelance filmmakers, photographers, digital storytellers who help people to have that voice. A lot of the people that we work with are in internet poverty. They don't get the chance to learn new digital skills, do creative things. When they are given the opportunity here, um, we see people thrive. For us it's really important to give people the opportunity to find the power of digital. So Digital Voice has an amazing team of people who um, go out into the community and do exciting digital media projects with people. So we're starting to develop a course that helps people to get employability skills by learning digital content creation, so TikTok, how to post on social media. And there's a TikTok trend which is about questions and answers. We're working with a group of adopted young people at the moment, so they think about all the questions that they're asked as an adopted person. And we do digital inclusion courses, so at the moment we're working with uh, groups in Gateshead in a fun and informal way, learn how to use a tablet, get online, stay safe, uh, shop and keep in touch with family and friends, which we've seen in the last couple of years is so important. We have a lot of work with older people, helping them to tell their stories by bringing in old photos and scanning them by looking things up on the internet if we're talking about something that happened in the past, looking that up, looking up old maps or looking for a photo of their old school and that's a fun, engaging way to get digital skills. So Digital Me is our award-winning project which helps people who are vulnerable have a voice about important issues. We help them to learn digitally and give them the skills to be able to take photos and manipulate photos and create photographic artwork and we create a safe space really, make sure that everyone understands that they're not going to be judged in that space, that they only have to talk about what they want to talk about and they draw their own avatar. So they draw a self-portrait that we then animate to speak their script. We always have an event at the end and invite people who can make decisions and change the situation that they're talking about in those local authorities. They feel that they're listened to. So we're always innovating on what we do and we've got some exciting new projects that we're working on at the moment to develop new ways of giving people a voice and getting new skills in the process.